Right now, literally not too many people here, just us media folks uh, for the most part. But we're expecting folks to start filing in, especially once we get closer to either those polls closing or once they're closed, you'll start seeing people coming in to watch what happens next, which of course will be those highly anticipated results that are going to be coming in. It's such so much on the line from the top of the ticket down. And joining us now to tell us more about it, we have State Senator with us, Fabian Donate. And uh, thank you so much for joining us, State Senator. I, I want to ask you, how are you feeling um, going into tonight's election with the polls closing in just less than two hours now. How are you feeling about the Democratic turnout? Well, today is election day and I am for one very, very excited. You know, Nevadans across the board are very excited to elect Kamala Harris as our next president and we've seen the momentum. Uh, we have just a couple of hours until the polls close and so we just want to make sure that we're getting out the vote uh, before so our voices can be heard. Now we've seen the polling that has had uh, Harris uh, t trailing uh, Donald Trump here in Nevada. We've also seen the numbers come out about early voting, saying that uh, the Republicans were outnumbering Democrats. Does that give you any pause? It doesn't give me any pause. You know, what we've seen over the last few years, because we have automatic voter registration, a lot of our voters are nonpartisan, but many of those nonpartisan voters are young voters like myself or people of color, right? Latinos, African Americans that are ready and excited to come and vote. And so we're going to see Nevada up front in the stage uh, today and, of course, and in the coming days. And we're just excited to elect Kamala Harris as our next president. And we were talking earlier about how a lot of the folks who voted early, uh, Republicans tended to vote early in person going to the polling sites, where as uh, your party, a lot of the people who follow you guys, the faithful, they mailed in those ballots. You think that'll make a big difference? 100 percent. You know, Democrats are, have been known to like mail-in ballots. My parents voted by a mail-in ballot. And so we're going to see a lot of those trickle in within the next 24 hours. And all of this is important. But what's most important is that before 7 o'clock that folks come out, if they haven't had the chance to and if they're in line to stay in line because their vote will count. That's right, and it's important to also uh, reiterate to everyone at home that if you are not registered, no worries, because you can register right there on the spot as well. And again, you have fewer than two hours to get out the vote. We want to thank you so much, Senator, for joining us. And of course, we'll be talking to more people as they start to trickle in here. But again, we are live at the area where the Dems are gathering tonight to watch these results come in. Back to you guys. All right, Latoya, thank you for that.